Hello, my name is Gerbsman, and today I'm going to show you sort of where we are on getting to the inside terminus from patrol. I'm also going to show you some uh, stuff of what you can do once you get to the other side, which is why I'm here in the strike today. Um, first off, on a completely different note, uh, apparently uh my last three videos yesterday uh did not have very good audio quality because um shadow play screwed me over so hang on if i if i actually go into shadow play i believe i can show you this but um if i go down here to audio you'll see that uh it says nvidia broadcast right here and then it also shows my controller but it was set to this microphone for no reason so that's that is my microphone but instead of running it through NVIDIA broadcast, so that is like, yeah. That is why you heard very loud noises when I banged the table on accident, so, uh, yeah. By the way, the spot I'm at right now is, um, somewhere you can, you can actually get here in patrol, but the problem is to get to the next section, you have to go through a teleporter, and, uh, that teleporter, hang on. Gotta like climb over and under stuff here. So that teleporter is essentially out of out of reach, and I'll show you you'd have to go around this big wall, but you can actually see through them. So give me a second. I will go through. Another thing is that um, I got some really great feedback from you guys yesterday. Um, no questions have come in yet, and once again, uh, if you have just, like, any random question about destiny or life or whatever you want me to answer, if I'm okay with answering it, I will, because I've got a lot of, like, open space in, in time where I just need to fill the airwaves. Um, a few of you asked for, uh, like, non-copyrighted music for me to play, um, by the way, I'm going to try to avoid this portal here. Hopefully I don't activate it from the outside, even though that I doubt you can. But hang on, if we pop our head through this, you'll see... Where is it? should be like right there, so maybe if I walk into this corner. Could be completely wrong on this, but I'm pretty sure it's back through there. Whatever, the point is that the map is, like, really far out of bounds down there, and it is completely out of the map, so, yeah. So, until we get some way to pierce through barriers, which, uh, who knows when that'll happen, we, uh, we're kind of stuck. And my dog wants attention here, so I'm gonna be doing this a little bit more scuffed because I'm now petting the dog with one hand and using the controller with another. And... Oh, he wants to go outside. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna cut the recording and then we'll be right back once, uh, once I get back over to the portal. And we are back. And the dog is happily roaming outside. What the heck? Is it animal? Oh, that's the thing up there, okay. So, another way we could potentially get in is by going through, or like, phasing through the barrier that's right here. I have no idea how you could do that. Uh, maybe a wall breach or something, I don't know, but... That's all just speculation, because we don't have a method quite yet. So, um... Another interesting thing is that this uh, portal does not let you return. Anyways... We're going to be making our way out of map from here, and we can do some exploration. It's actually interesting the way this whole, this whole place is set up, but first, we must uh, go up this way. I have good news. Shut up, failsafe, and don't care about your news. Give us the good news first. The good news is that Cargan is killing Vex by the dozen. Alright, what's the bad news? Cargan has almost complete control over the Vex gate network. I predict several detachments of Cabal over the next few minutes. 
Wonderful. All right. Now we can just casually jump out of the map. Right through this gap. There we go. First thing that you can do is uh, walk back and uh, see where you are from the other side. And that's exactly what I'm going to do here. Oh yeah, what I was saying about non-copyrighted music. I can do that, but at the same time, I really don't like that sort of style of video. Just in general. Also, I'd much rather just answer simple questions than deal with the uh, whole track editing and volume tuning. So anyways, uh... There's the map. There's You can actually go out and stand on those things, uh, but that's a long sword fly and I kind of want to conserve ammo here. Um, there's the capture plate, um, and we were actually looking at that corner, so it was actually in the place that I thought it was in. So, uh, yeah. But now we're going to head back, because the interesting stuff is over here. Uh, be careful if you're doing this like me and using solo mode because uh, if you die you gotta You gotta get out of map again. You lose all your progress. So Yeah, I would not recommend it uh, Oh, I need my other armor here By the way if you do a lot of glitching like me a good suggestion is to uh sort of coordinate your armor with ornaments so i can see that with this set which i forget the name of it but it's from season dawn that is my discipline build uh this one is my mobility and strength build don't worry about the stat roll on that helmet <laughs> it's fine <laughs> and then this is my intellect build so i personally like that system um it just helps with organization, so you don't have to look at like specific rolls every time, you can just click at them at a glance. Alright. I'm gonna just do a bit of stasis climbing here. Not too much for right now, but... If I run over here, you might notice that this over here is, uh, in fact, the Cargan Arena, because for some reason, Bungie, uh, I don't actually know why they do it like this, but this whole area is loaded, but there's no, uh, but there's no, like, skybox, like, around it, so, we fly over here. Is like the pathway down there too but yeah oh wait do I have to oh right I have to clear the okay I guess we're gonna be going up this way most of the solid stuff here is still solid in this checkpoint but let me tell you it's a little bit annoying to do this in the uh, in the like actual proper checkpoint version of this all because everything is like significantly everything is significantly darker and also you need to uh, do fun things like avoid everything and there's more stuff to avoid and it's all invisible <laughs> like this and I have gotten myself stuck Ah, there we go.
So, um, I haven't actually gotten any questions yet for this. Otherwise, this would be like a perfect time to pull one out. Um, I mean, other than the occasional uh, gaming from Seuss, but that isn't really truly a question. Although, my answer to that will always be gaming, so. Alright, so I guess we're stuck down here. We can always climb up and around, but I really didn't want to, but whatever. Yeah, that is the other problem. You guys aren't in the habit of uh, asking questions because they just started the system. <laughs> and so there will always be a drought, so I do rely on you, but, you know, I'm not going to blame you. We just started the system. Oh, we can just climb this. Okay. Although a pulse jump didn't work right. Or catapult, whatever this is. Uh, oh yeah, I was doing a lot of D1 yesterday, and I have to say, that is something that, if you can play D1, it is like something, it is something nice to go back to once in a while, um, especially sort of in the middle to end of season lull that we're in right now. Although it isn't as bad as like, uh season of worthy where i literally it was it worthy yeah it's yeah okay yeah um where you know there was nothing to do after like two weeks so i ended up becoming like just like maining d1 for like half a season and that's when i started learning how to sparrow fly and stuff like that But yeah, I found, yeah, I did, I did a few different, like, uh, vaults, uh, vault runs, and apparently, something I didn't know is that if you, uh, if you leave the, somebody inside one of the portals for too long, it spawns an oracle, who knew? Guess it's some kind of, like, I don't know, but here we go, now we're in. A very weird and unloaded version of the Cargan Arena. Uh, and, you know, we are out of the box technically in this part, so you will... I think this checkpoint's considered boxless, but... Either way, you have free reign to explore everything. I didn't show it, but you can actually, like, sit on those rings and, like, rotate around. But now, we head back this way. And there's also that structure you can fly out to, but... Not really much to see. Yeah, come on. You know, who needs non-copyrighted music when you have just random ambient strike music? Now we begin the big climb up. And I fall back down. <laughs> uh, 
whatever we can stasis climb. I'm pretty sure there is a path to get all the way up without it, but... Whatever, why, why would you ever use something that's not stasis? So, um, oh yeah, by the way, another thing I forgot to mention, uh, go ahead and DM me on Discord. I don't care. If you, if you want to send messages there, uh, a few people have already DM me with, like, random glitches and stuff. I mean, that's how, that's how Susan and I started talking, but, uh. Yeah, go ahead and send me suggestions and comments or Discord. Um, yeah, I just don't send me anything weird, please. That's my one caveat, because yeah, I understand that opening my accounts to the internet is probably not the best thing. Alright, I did not meant to use mountain top there, but it seems to have worked. We're almost up. Yeah, um... Yeah, I'm still having, obviously struggling with not being able to find something to say. I don't have any questions yet. Okay, there we go. And we're up. If we, uh, if we head back this way, actually, we can go over to... Oh, wait, no, this is, uh, this is the other side of the checkpoint. Just ended up going backwards. And I am sucking at the game. Alright, if we head back this way, we should, in theory, get back to uh, this checkpoint again. It is very dark in here, so I think I'm just going to stasis climb. What the heck is that crystal formation, man? <laughs> I can't stasis climb on that. Or I can, but I don't want to. Can we see Gargan yet? No. Okay. If I had walked a little bit further in, we could have actually seen the animation from the other side. Uh, I don't want to trigger it, so... Alright, now we head back. Except, I'm not going to be able to show you. Uh, so, there is a way, in theory, for you to get in. However, it is not friendly if you want to stay within the TOS of Destiny. <laughs> um, so basically, hang on, we're gonna hit Quiet Epiphany here again. There we go. Um, first off, I'll show you the auto map because I don't want to climb up that hole again. Uh, this one was found, I believe, by... Um, if I remember correctly, it was found by Exotic Tentacles. Or Zombie, depending on whether or not you're looking at his Discord or his gamertag. And... 
Yeah, what you need to do to hit it is you need to stasis melee up. I just failed that. So I think what I'm gonna do is uh, fail my stasis. I'm just not having a great time right now. <laughs> Oh yeah, by the way, if you're curious why I just randomly put down a barricade sometimes, uh, it is occasionally because I... Ah, uh, come on. You can also use a thunder crash to get up, but... Eh, yeah, whatever. I'll cut back to that, but that is how one would get down. And I missed the slam, that's unfortunate. But this is why we can't continue right here. For some reason that's that gave me an immune. That's weird. Anyways, um so the way you could in theory get past this is to unplug your ethernet cord and then Oh, whoa, what the heck? Yeah, you could in theory unplug your ethernet cord, run down here and plug it back in. However, I can't recommend that because that's net limiting and against the TOS, so... Oh hey, that's a thing now. So, yeah. I think that's about it for the video. Um, you can do some exploration. I personally haven't found a way in, but... Uh... Yeah, I, I'll, I'll leave that up to you. So, yeah, thanks for, uh, thanks for watching. Is there something under here? Yeah. Uh, more just weird little cracks in the thing. Alright, so. Let me respawn here. Maybe I'll respawn up top. I do, nice, okay. Yeah, uh, that hole right there is the way you would probably get back in. Anyways, you can jump up and over and back down into the boss area, but you'll notice that there's a giant cave around it now. So, uh, yeah, good find a... Good luck finding a chink in that, so, yeah. So, thanks for watching. Um, I don't really have any more content planned, so it'll probably go back to, uh, go back to the regular scheduled, uh, schedule of just <laughs> whatever, whatever is found is found, I guess. I don't know. So, thanks for watching, and pretend there's a cool outro. Also, uh, Put your comments down so I don't have to struggle like that again, please. Please.